And if I manage to pull off the rest of this workout, that means that literally I'm trying to pull only from your shoulders. It's like fucking what? It's just, you know what? To be honest, I'm not just not feeling. Ooh, shit. You're amazing! It is now 5.38 and I am gonna make an attempt to do my workout today. My day, I don't know what day it is. I think it's day eight. Even though I had a nice big lunch, I am definitely gonna get, do a small pre-workout because I don't know how intense the workout is gonna be today because I did not look at the program and I know that I told myself that I would start looking at the program, so I'm not surprised. <laughs> but it's just not working out that way. <laughs> Let's go. Full disclosure, I am absolutely not feeling it at all today. I've just not been feeling it. I thought that there would be more days that I would feel motivated to do it, but it turns out that most of the time I really don't think that I'm going to get through the workout and I don't feel like doing it. But what do we do before every workout? Get the hair out of the way. I'm not gonna show you this time. Look at this little bun right there. For some reason, my tonal isn't turning on. All the obstacles, all the obstacles. I just unplugged it, so it's turning on. <laughs> you know what, to be honest, I'm not just not feeling. Ooh, shit, what the hell? It isn't just that I'm not feeling motivated today. I am also feeling nauseous right now. at this exercise and I'm thinking, does Chrissy Chella understand that she's creating this program for the average person and the below average person like myself? What? Watch me annihilate this specific exercise like the clumsy. If you're wondering, yes, I'm still feeling nauseous and should I be drinking a pre-workout while I'm feeling nauseous? Absolutely not, but I'm ignoring it for now. I just wanna confirm that exercise is absolutely unfair and if you're anything like me, do not attempt it. I'm kidding. Challenge yourself. Let me tell you what the most challenging part of that exercise is. One, I've never done it before and two, trying to keep your shoulder blades retracted and trying to pull only from your shoulders is like fucking what? It's just... understanding the logic behind putting plank arms out after I just did what I just pulled off and my shoulders are killing me. How? How? 20 reps? 20 reps, Chrissy? I'm giving you 10. I just want to confirm I have very, very, very limited fitness background. I have started a couple fitness journeys that lasted like two weeks tops and they were really easy. I have never actually tried to go gung-ho with something. So this is my first time. A lot of the, these exercises are brand new to me like this one that I just accomplished. Like, so if I'm pulling something like this off and if I manage to pull off the rest of this workout, that means that literally, if you ignore your excuses, you can succeed. That particular exercise was not really hard, but that was also the first time that I did it. I have to say, they really do look very intimidating. I'm really confident that I can make it through this whole workout, so I'm just gonna keep going because I've already proven to myself that I can, so. You better hold your head up to the sky. Day I die. Not my butt though. I don't want my butt to get bigger because, you know, I'm too small for a big butt. 
I literally put it down to six pounds because I wanted to make sure that I can get through the 16 reps and even at six pounds. It was still really difficult. If you're not putting any weight on the leg that's going down to the floor, at any point in the exercise, it's really, really hard to cheat and you're really just using your quads and it's just murder. It's just murder. <laughs> say that I find it extremely difficult to do these push-up exercises and I never think I'm doing it right in terms of form and stuff. I think I did like seven reps and yeah. I'm now gonna post this on my Instagram. So follow me on Instagram so you can get a real live update on my workout journey because obviously these videos are not rolling out in real time. So if you want like a real time update on my transformation, follow me on Instagram. Yeah, I did it! Another workout completed and another step on your level up journey. You're amazing! Hi. Oh, and um, please like this video because if you're like me and you forget to like videos on your way out, this is your reminder. Please like the video on your way out because you want to tell me and YouTube that I have potential because I do. And really looking forward to see you in my next video. Is that all? Yeah, that's it. So, see you in my next video. <laughs>